back in December, Crystal Palace Football Club teamed up with Mumbai City in India as part of a groundbreaking initiative to find one young footballer to come and play for Palace and spend one week training in our world-famous academy. Raul Lewis. Over 300 young hopefuls battled it out for the opportunity of a lifetime. But in the end, one young man stood out from all the rest. The youngest player in the group. Four months on and after completing an intensive training programme created by our specialist coaching team, Drubman made the trip from Bombay to Beckenham, via Salhurst Park, to meet up with his new teammates and experience firsthand the life of Academy Prospect. <laughs> And this is what it's all about, really, the opportunity to come here and train and play with some of our best emerging talent. And if you really want to realise your dream of playing in the Premier League, this is where the journey begins. Our students will arrive here at about quarter past eight in the morning. They'll do an hour and a half session till 10 o'clock. They then get mini bussed up to the school, have a normal school day. Then they're minibus back to the training ground at Copa's Cove. And then they have another hour and a half session. And then they're back here for 8.15 again in the morning. The Crystal Palace Academy players have been coming to school with us at Oasis Shirley Park for the last four years. So whilst they train with the club, they also come to school and that means that the boys get a full education studying all of the subjects of school at the same time as being able to train at the highest professional levels. He's been here two days, he's done three sessions so far and I think he's probably enjoyed all three. You know, he's not looked out of place, you know, he's joined in, he, you know, the lads are giving him the ball, they want to find him. Um, I think he's probably been shocked a bit by the pace and the intensity, he's done really well. Session over Rich, how did Drummond do? Do well, do very well. I mean, the intensity of the training is, uh, is, is, is very quick, very sharp. Looking at outside, looking in, I thought he set in really well. So some really good touches, enthusiasm, the tempo the session was good. What do you think uh, that our boys have learned from him? Manners. Really? Absolutely. Manners, he's come in and, he, you know, he's, I've looked at him now, he's, he's got the balls and he's, he's been very respectful. Um, good attitude, yeah. very good attitude to training. Of course, every young player dreams of making it into the first team. And at Palace, we have a rich history of bringing young talent through. You've got Waldy's hair, you've got like Waldy's hair going on there. So he's going to play tomorrow against the Millwall and then he's going to come down here, guest of honour, watch the game, um, get to introduce the crowd at half time. Listen, well done, all the best for the weekend, okay? Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. All the best tomorrow? Yeah. Uh, well, we'll see you around. Thank you very nice to meet you, man. Thank Good you. tempo and the speed of the game is uh, a lot different to India and um, you know certainly Millwall a big side. Technically he's been as good as Yuri, you know he's had a couple of good touches, you know found a couple of passes. Obviously it's a long time now yeah. since we had the trials in Mumbai. What, what was the wait like waiting to come over? Um, each day seemed to be like a month for me. I was like Counting each and every day, like it was really exciting thinking about yeah, uh, Crystal Palace, and now I'm finally here. I'm enjoying it. 
Did it live up to your expectations? It, w it is more than my expectations. I expected, you know, I expected like playing normal matches and stuff, but it's a lot more than that. Obviously during your experiences you met uh, the manager, lots of the first team players yesterday. How did that feel? It was a great feeling. It was like a dream come true meeting players like Wilfred Zaha and Belaisi. Uh, Alan Pardew, the, you know, I'm a big fan of him. The way he teaches, you know, he guides his players. Yeah, it was a great experience. It was an experience of a lifetime. It's been an incredibly positive experience for Drovmill and Crystal Palace Football Club. And who knows, perhaps the skills he's learnt this week will help Drovmill become the first Indian-born Premier League superstar. But whatever the future holds for this impressive young man from Mumbai, I'm sure this week's experience of training and playing with some of our experienced coaches and great prospects will hold him in good stead for whatever he decides to do in the future.